What is up, you guys? Your friendly neighborhood Boon Slayer here. God, I forgot how scary those sounds are. Um, so, a little bit of a technicality on on my end with this with this particular guys. Shut up! I'm trying to talk. Jeez. With this particular playthrough, there is a small technicality. See, if I hit F3, I'm not technically at um at the proper Y coordinate. However, small caveat, the rules do not say that I have to, that I cannot collect resources on my way down. Which is essentially what I'm doing here. And as you can see, I have a full lake here. Basically, I'm not going to be able to take the whole lake with me, unfortunately. And there's mobs in places, and I need to be careful, though. I do need to be careful, because right on the other side of that wall are mobs, and I don't want to let those guys in. They're jerks. So, what I want to do is I want to go ahead and make a furnace with the intention of taking it with me. And just uh, go ahead and smelt some iron. In fact, there's another piece, there's a couple more pieces of iron down here. See, the places that I'm hearing these sounds come from is really scary. Go ahead and grab this piece of iron. And while this iron is cooking, I'm going to collect other resources. Like more iron, for example. Okay, good. That doesn't let anyone in. I've got to be careful about this. This is the just about the only time you'll see me digging. But from in this room, I can actually just go ahead and uh, I'm not far. Jesus, there's so much stuff. I'm glad I'm not staying here. Oh, what if the cave I'm going into connects to it, though? That's going to be a concern. So I'm going to need some wood. First of all, I can break these, try to get some seeds. No luck. Alright. Now I want some dirt. Um, let's see if breaking this lets people in. If so, five. Nope. Okay. So how much coal is that? 41? I think a little bit more will help. It's really scary to hear all that right beside me. Okay, so it looks like I can just safely grab all this. And I think here I want to grab low first because I know this is going to... Yep. I know that's going to open up. Um, if I had... Tell you what, I will keep this iron for now. Break the furnace. Next time we're going to use it is further down. Whoa! Hi, bat! Wait, there's a bat that okay <laughs> there's not other stuff good that is very good Jesus okay I'm getting creeped out I need to stop yes I know my battery's running low thank you phone um but yeah I I know I'm getting creeped out so but it's spooky scary down here um, I need at least one bucket you know what I'm gonna I think I should, I need at least one bucket. Ah, actually craft the thing, Boone. Dang. Quit being a baby about it. Alright, I don't think I want to go on that side. I think I want to go on maybe this, no. Where can I dig down? Um. 
But actually, I need to use the bucket right now, so let me just do that. Bucket. There we go. So here's, so I'm thinking, I was thinking of trying to dig straight down. But then I realized that was a dumb idea. So what I'm going to do instead is grab my crafting table. I want, I'm going to keep this, this whole place lit up. Do I, do I have enough dirt? I got 10 dirt. I think I'll get a little bit more dirt. All right. I don't really have more food, but that's okay. I don't really need more food right now. Let's see, we're at level 19. We're almost there, guys. And what I'm gonna do, I'm not gonna do what what other people are doing and uh, look for a cave. All right, I don't want to go up there anymore. Here's 15. Dig a little bit further down. Oh good, Lapis. We'll need that if we start enchanting. How far down are we? 11? I think we'll go down to 10. Let me do this. Uh, maybe 8. Yeah, eight seems like a good height, because then we can go all the way up to the tree when, once it grows. Eight. Okay. So now that we're here, I'm going to place a torch here for now. I'm definitely going to be changing that placement later. I'm a little... I, I have no reason to be scared about um, wood, so let's just go ahead and turn that all into planks. Mostly about having to use wood for coal. So, um, what I'm going to do is instead of looking for a cave. I'm going to make one. I'm basically going to be making my house here. Um, I'm going to put this a little bit higher up. There we go. I'm thinking I need at least a 5x5 five five area, and then I'm going to start going upwards with it. This 3x3 three three is, is, is nice, but we need more. So, let's just dig out some walls. Let me make sure, because... I'm not 100% sure when the marker is going to come. All right. Yeah, the only thing is this is going to eat through hunger. Ooh, redstone. Lapis. Let's go ahead and dig some of this out. Okay. Five. One, two, three, four, five. Alright. Is this gonna be big enough? I hope so. I need at least a seven block overhead. And what I'm gonna end up doing is I'm gonna end up digging out from here. to get myself room to get myself for one to expand my house a little bit because this is a pretty small house but for two to try to get myself more resources 
because I'm pretty much stuck on iron right now. I mean, I've got lapis and I've got redstone. And I could very well use some lapis blocks for decoration and some redstone blocks too. For that matter, if I find gold, I can make a clock to make it easier to tell when that happens. I'm not hearing any mob sounds, which is partially a bad thing. Because I do want to find the cave. As, scare as scary as places with mobs are going to be. Alright, when digging out the appropriate amount, what should end up happening is, uh, One, two, three, four, five, six. Almost enough. So one more ought to do it. Got to use all of my vertical reach. I probably should have gone ahead and made two buckets and gotten more water. Home sweet home. Now, I don't really care about most of the rest of this area. In fact, I don't care about that above me. But I'm not going to just put cobblestone there. Because we're living fancy. That's what we're doing. Polished diorite. All up in there. When we get more andesite, we'll go ahead and use some of that for some wall decoration. Um, I, I am kind of the master of jump placement. And we basically know what's in that direction. Alright, I'm going to need another iron pick, but that's fine. We got our house. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and dig out the entire floor. more iron it's gonna be good and we need a new pick but that's fine all right so first let's take our fancy fancy wall and put it there um we'll go ahead and grab some dirt put it on our bar we've already got seeds on our bar we need to make a hoe So let's go ahead and get the uh, crafting table on our bar, because we don't need polished diorite right now. Oh, but the torches. We need the torches. We need to place them a little bit up. Um, put this one a block up, so for consistency's sake. And we're probably going to want to make more torches, too. All right, so place the crafting table in the corner here. What was that? That was spooky. All right. Um. So what we're going to want to do is... Oh, I don't have enough for another pick yet. That's okay. Just uh, plop a furnace down and uh, cook a little bit. It'll be fine. So first thing we're going to do in that case is make a stone hoe. We could make a stone pick. Go ahead and use that. But, nah. Alright, now right here in the middle of our room, we're going to go ahead and play some dirt. Get that hoe. We don't need... We don't need hoed dirt. I'm stupid. We just need to plant our sapling. 
I didn't kill any skeletons, so I'm not expecting. All right, we can, we'll probably be able to make this room wider as we go along. But you can see what we're doing. Oh, I don't have enough dirt. Oh well, I could probably get more somewhere. I didn't get enough dirt. That's fine. Um, go ahead and place our water. That will not put out the furnace. Appreciate it. And this should give us everything we need to grow all our stuff. If we find another water source, we should really use that. I think... Yeah, I think I don't have enough seeds yet anyway. So... All right. So I guess if we're going to advance, I guess we'll start with this corner once we um wait, we have our iron. Okay. So we're going to need a few more torches too. So, we'll get on that. And I'm being a little bit conservative with a uh, a lot of stuff right now. Simply because I know how limited our supplies are. In fact, I'm only going to make like four or 60 more torches. Four more groups, as I like to call them. So here's the deal. We're going to just go ahead and dig this out. Um, you know, let's get our polished diorite on our bar so that we have something to place that's pretty. Right. Go ahead and go all the way around by one block. This this part does not have to be seven high. So our torches are still in the right place. Oh, I'll have to get rid of some diorite, but that's okay. Oh, it looks like that was diorite I didn't need. Okay, good. Yeah, most of our diorite covers up holes. So basically, I'm going to kind of dig like that while stuff is growing. Oh, hang on. Almost. And this is going to be... We're approaching the end of day two. I'm going to go ahead and get in my spiel. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Um... Next time, I'm probably going to continue this digging process. Hopefully, we get somewhere with it. You know, just going to leave that up. As you can see, I am at the proper height now. And I'm probably going to stop digging if I don't really find anything. Um, one thing I want to find is more dirt. Let's go ahead and uh, diorite that in, because we want a pretty ceiling, too. I think. Day three. Um, hope you guys enjoyed it. Until next time, this is Friendly Neighborhood Boonslayer, signing out. Bye!